Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the adventures of Tardy Penis and Juanathan. Um, I did something that I thought I wouldn't do, but I did do it. I looked at the wiki. Aww. But I only did that because I didn't want to miss out on any cool stuff. So today we're going to be going around here looking at stuff. I only looked at one thing on the wiki, by the way, <laughs> so I didn't spoil myself on anything. I literally was just looking at quest givers. Oh, hello. Do I know you? Hmm. I don't believe I've seen you before. Fascinating. Yes, I don't. to Bruma, is that what we have here? I uh, see so you're the welcoming committee. Uh, I'm not trying to stir up trouble. I'll just be going. Uh, I'm not trying to stir up any trouble. Many before you have said the same. Many before you have reneged on that notion almost as soon as they'd emptily recited it. They now find themselves hanging from trees, their decrepit husks wasting away amidst near endless blizzard. Enjoy your stay in this fair city. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Just threaten me. I just got here, dude. Uh You're a member of the no, Thalmor? I just wear the uniform for fun. Yes, of course I am. I'm here to protect the Aldmeri interests in Bruma and ensure that the terms of the White Gold Concordat are upheld. Important, given that we're so close to Skyrim and its rebellious little Nords. Well, I'm an Argonian. I know nothing of Skyrim. Sky what? Rim what? Job? Do you have Not one for me? highly of me, I suppose. Oops. And then again, the feeling is mutual. Cool. Next, you'll be telling me, my, oh my, not many guar in Bruma. Scales of I don't know what that is. L. Thanks for telling me that. I'll be sure to tell all my friends. Put up posters, even. Okay. How about we cut the verbal sparring and have a civil conversation? To hear you speak of civility is somewhat disarming, considering our environs. This city is filled with uncultured louts who I suspect would quickly turn on each other for an ancient bottle of mead. Given that you at least have the vocabulary and mental faculties to understand the concept of civil society, yes, let us speak. But be quick about it. Disarming lack of incorrigible idiocy aside, you are still not my idea of a scintillating conversationalist. Okay. Why the attitude? <laughs> What are your real goals? Uh, what are your real goals for the Thalmor and Bruma? I will put it in simple terms, so perhaps you might understand. The Aldmeri Dominion signed an accord with the Empire, known as the White Gold Concordat. That accord guarantees the Dominion, and by extension the Thalmor, that Talos worship shall be outlawed. We are simply here to ensure that the Empire does not renege on that commitment. So you're Inquisitors. Don't you feel guilty about persecuting people for their beliefs? Sure. Guilt. Why should I feel guilt? I'm a Thalmor Justitia, yes, but the Aldmeri Dominion is not just, a single continent. Justitia? I've always this heard it pronounced just a car. political entity. It has committed untold acts of persecution and genocide in the past. One need only have a cursory knowledge of the Tiber Wars and Imperial history to know this to be true. Well, I have neither of Tiber those. Septim, so fuck you. God so many Nords and Imperials love to revere was himself guilty of the sins you attribute solely to the Dominion. But I digress. I am a soldier of the Thalmor, and I carry out the duties assigned to me by my superiors. If your goal is to make me feel guilty for enforcing dictates which your own emperor signed into law, then I'm afraid you will enjoy precious little success. Cool. So why the attitude? I am Altmer. I was born and raised among the wizard lords of Alinor, and now I am posted to a frigid squat filled with brutes and drunkards. That doesn't exactly lend itself to a warm disposition. Does that make things any clearer? Actually, yeah. Then it appears I was incorrect in my initial assessment of you. Hmm. 
Hmm. Though don't flatter yourself. We're not best friends simply because I've stopped pelting you with barbed <laughs> words. But yes, to put a long story short, we are all products of our environment, are we not? True that. Do you enjoy forcing the concordant then? I haven't given it very much thought. My enjoyment is irrelevant. I have a role within the Thalmor, and the duties which go along with that. I have fulfilled and will continue to fulfill that which is asked of me to the best of my ability. Again, my enjoyment, or otherwise, is irrelevant. Okay, soldier. Tell me a bit about yourself. No. Okay. If anything fruitful is going to come of this conversation, it will not be the sentimental exchange of life stories. Suffice it to say that I am a Thalmor Justitia operating in Bruma. My identity outside of that is entirely irrelevant. Well. Farewell. Thanks for wasting my time, buddy. It was fun. What the hell was I saying? There's a guy over here that'll give me a quest. That's all I, <laughs> that's all I was freaking trying to say in the Great Hall. Excuse me, sorry to bother. I don't suppose you've seen any priceless Sakaviri heirlooms gallivanting around Bruma, have you? No, I have not. Lie? Actually, yes, I have a whole barrel of them in my pack. You know, that could probably actually be true, but I'm not going to tell him that. <laughs> sorry to bother you, citizen. Just, uh, let me know if any do crop up, yeah? Thanks. Uh, what's all this about Vakian heirlooms? What's it like to be a Bruma guard captain? I don't a care. A uproar about nothing, that's why. The Count's been nagging my life and soul out about the damn things. You see, the Carvanes have a sort of family tradition. They've acquired a taste for Akaviri artifacts, constantly collecting more and more. Been going on for centuries now. Well, it turns out poor old Count Desilus... <laughs> Count Carvane isn't too happy that his collection's been stolen. Ah. You want some help with that? Well, erm, um, good luck. <laughs> I... Well, that's... Ah, oh, who am I kidding? Absolutely. <laughs> this is driving me crazy. Hell yeah, dude. Just bring them back to me when you found them and I'll be extremely appreciative. And I mean extremely appreciative. Hello, sir. Seriously. I feel like offing myself. Can I help you? Now. We're having a talk about sewer slide. Could you please move? How did the thief even get inside the I have castle? No idea how they'd manage that, honestly. Either adept stealth cool. or good luck. Probably a bit of both. Okay. When and how were the artifacts I'm not stolen? Not sure on the details of that, to be honest. Rignar, the castle steward, was the first one who noticed them missing. Might be worth speaking to him if you think that's interesting evidence to dig up. Why would the thief want artifacts? Monetary value or...? Almost definitely the resale value. Akaviri artifacts are very often one of a kind, and they can fetch a very high price to the right buyers. Someone possessing those artifacts could find themselves becoming very wealthy... Very like quickly. a museum of I some sort? that's the motive here. What exactly was stolen? Akaviri artifacts. I don't know anything more specific than that. Cool. Rignar and the Count both told me, but honestly, it flew in one ear and out the other. If you want to know exactly what artifacts to keep your eyes peeled for, talk to Rignar. I'm sure he can help you more there. Any suspects? Not in particular. Then again, the low lives of Bruma don't exactly hide themselves all that well. The shadier tavern in town, the restful watchman, full of thieves, bandits, thugs, and other miscreants, might be a decent place to start your search. Hmm. Okay, now what's it like being a guard? It's tough. On one side, you've got criminals. The kind that like to hide behind law and policy to wriggle out of justice. On the other, you've got politics, constantly meddling in our affairs as everyone walks on eggshells. And here I am in the center, just trying to make things work for the people. Sometimes I wish I'd stayed down in the Imperial City. 
Rip. Oh, here we go. More questions. As a Bruma, oh, Bruma has a problem with criminals. Far. We have it fairly okay compared to some other parts of the province. The problem is that the criminals here aren't driven to it out of desperation. They just want the coin to get rich. They know how to game the system. Except Dartakto. He's well, never mind. I've probably told you too much. Okay. Go on. You can tell me. No, I, I can't. Fuck. Sorry, but I can't go blabbing about people's checkered pasts. Oh, well, hold on, hold on. You had more to say. Calm down. You know, it's even more satisfying than arresting a criminal. Seeing them rot in a cell. Okay. You're from the Imperial City? Yep, me and my family. Wife and children are still there, in fact. Left because the place is swarming with people. Hard to find any work. Came up here, couldn't find much work either. Joined the guard on a whim. Saw a lot, rose to the ranks. And now I'm guard captain. Funny how things work out. I try to take my duties seriously. And send as much as I can back to my loved ones. Politics often get in the way of your work? More than you might think. Between the Count, the White Gold Concordat, and all the other treaties, the rules are constantly changing. All I want to do is protect these people, jail criminals, earn my keep. But then the damned wind changes, and with it, the law. And then, what do you know, I'm supposed to jail this group, and that group, and the other group. And for what? For politics. Despite it all, though, I wouldn't trade this job for the world. It's rewarding, fulfilling. And at least it lets me provide for myself and my family. Well, he seems like a good man. I will trust you Very for well. the time being. So, let us go to the journal is what I meant to do. It just says retrieve him. Nothing more, nothing less. And I'm not seeing a marker on the map. Unless I'm stupid again. And what was this place called? Snowstone Rest. Okay. Okay. So now we gotta find... Rocknar or whatever the hell his name was. Rignar. I'm the Count Stubud here in Pruma. If there is anything you need, I'll try my best to help you. Ooh, I'm looking for bounty. He's got there an alien. popping up constantly. Here. Take a look at this bounded decree for details. Hmm. Cool. Anyway, this guy hired me to talk about the solar the artifacts. Captain's actually looking into it. Excellent. Can't have the Carvain artifact collection lost to some random burglar. Did you see the thief? What happened? I didn't know. Did you see the I theft? I was just doing the rounds here in the castle. I was about to go to bed for the night when I noticed something. Normally, there's a little glint in the corner of my eye. The light bouncing off of one of the Akaviri amulets. But this time, nothing. I went to investigate, and the artifacts were gone. That's odd. I'm sorry I can't be of more use. Mm-hmm. And what exactly the were missing? Some rings, a katana, all of Akaviri design. A katana? Priceless relics. Very valuable, and very well loved by the Count. Best of luck with your investigation. Yeah, okay, that didn't really help or give me a waypoint. Let's talk to this guy. Great war effects, Bruma. Tell me about Bruma, what's all you kind of Bruma? Goodbye. Hmm. Marcius Carve, Viscount Bruma. The title garners a lot of respect and a fair few privileges. Anyway, how can I help you? Until okay. next time. Don't care. Looking for maybe where these artifacts were stolen. Maybe there's a clue or something. I doubt it, but maybe not. Okay. He's in a little bit of a hurry, I guess. So... Let's see if there's any. Ah, uh, those are probably the books he wrote. Cool. Don't care. Oh, what the fuck? 
soul gem just sitting there? Ah, uh, why can't I have these books? I mean, if I crouch, am I... Okay. Finally, I went through all these books and took what I wanted. Hello, ma'am. Hello, I am Athana Adichie. I'm part she does of not care about me. Rather high ranking in it you got something to do. Don't worry about it. Oh, I'm okay. Lord's Manor. No. There's no, I guess there's no, like, display or something that I can look at. Oh, well. Not much I can do here. So, I'm thinking we go to that bar and ask around. I think that's our next plan. And our next step in the plan. I've already forgotten what that bar was called. Oh my fucking god, that lady disappeared right in front of my eyes. Wait. Cool. Just stood in the doorway for a day, that's fine. Uh, does it say on my... I keep hitting that to go to the journal when I could be doing it a different way, I bet. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh. Ah. Just says retrieve them. It doesn't say how. I am going to go find this bar then. I can't remember what it's called, but as soon as I hear about it, I'll know. Oh, also there's this uh, missive board that's got new stuff in it. Just needs soul gems and stuff, but I'm not going to muddy up more of my crap just for that. I believe there was a bar down here, if I'm not mistaken, which I probably am. No. Yeah, these are all the, uh... The Restful Watchmen. Was that the bar? Now I'm confused. Now I don't know. Now I'm starting to think I should have looked at the wiki a lot more. <laughs> Then not at all. Can I help you? Crouches and crevices? Can I help you? <laughs> what a fucking good name. Please, sir. Just one septim. You're literally drinking it away. I'm not Farewell. giving it to you. The septim for an Argonian down on his luck. No way it was just a coincidence. It must have been. Oh, hello. What are you looking at? Speak. What are you mumbling about? I, that's none of your... I suppose there's no harm in telling you now. Who knows? Maybe you'll be able to help. I'm a mercenary. Been mm -hmm. one for years now. And I don't often fail a job. But this last time, I did fail. But not through any fault of my own. Let me guess. You need a hero. Mm, could you use some help? Tell me more. Tell me more. Did you use some help? Well, I suppose I could, yeah. You'll need to know more about the job first, though. I'd been hired by some anonymous <laughs> noble to clear out a cave full of bandits near Bruma. Offer some nice coin, too. My wife came with me. We're battle partners. Things were going well. And That's fucking we sick. Ambushed. Bandit reinforcements showed up out of nowhere, flanking us the way we <clears> came. <throat> they bound us and gagged us, left us disarmed and defeated. They left with my wife and left me to die. I managed to escape my captivity, but when I got back to the cave, they'd gone. All of them, including my wife. I've been searching for her damn near a whole year now. Oh. No success. Jeez, okay. Uh, yeah, I'll definitely help Praise you. Praise Malachath. Once you turn up something solid, let me know. I'll be here. The best place to start is probably the castle. Ask the nobles, see if they know anything. Okay, cool. Ugly love. That's rude. 
He's beautiful, love. The restful watchman. Rooms and food, that's what we do. What cool. do you need? Heard anything about the stolen I don't artifacts? Tend to gossip about my patrons. Bad for business, you know, especially when you're in my line of work. Just tell me. Don't want any legal com complications. Well, true enough. There's this Breton guy who comes through here every now and again. Sleaziest guy I've ever seen. Except for me, of course. Got a reputation <laughs> to maintain, you know? Okay. Weird flex. Or something like that. Anyway, he mentioned something to do with Akaviri trinkets while we spoke. Mentioned wanting to sell them or something. I guess he's your man. Where can I find 18? Uh, I don't know. Listen, do you really think I'm going to tell you everything about my customers? That's a sure way to get run out of this business. Answer me or you'll lose more than patrons. Listen, you want me to tell you so badly? Make me. I'm not budging until I've been forced to, legally. You know what I'm getting at, I assume. Hmm. Oh, well, careful, I don't want to... Uh... Huh. I guess everyone knows how shady this place is. Uh, what was the prompt it said? Find a way to pressure Bentor. You. Give him more information. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go back to the Lord and see if I can have him write up a, a thingy-mabob. Like a document that'll say, hey, fuck you. Okay, Ugly Love didn't, didn't put a waypoint on, so I do have to go over here. So it seems... Okay, why are there two waypoints? Actually... Okay. Well, they're right outside, right next to each other, so I might as well just take a look at both of them. Think any of those dragons from Skyrim will find their way over here? Okay, here we go. We can just tell him. Bentior wants legal pressure. <laughs> that can certainly be arranged. Take. Oh, this. see? It's exactly what I wanted. Signature. Show it to him, and he's sure to change his tune. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. That's exactly what I wanted the other guy to do anyway. Oop. Shit. Well met, Rilja. Well, this is a bit... I'm back. Can I help you? And I've got a little paper what? that says fuck you. Let me you. see that. Oh, damn. Fine. I'll tell you what I know. Listen, I heard the thief had some dealings with some... Uh, fellow businessmen holed up in the Gerald's. You'd probably call them bandits, though. I tell you, no respect for the profession these days. Here, just so I don't have to go sit in a cell again, I'll mark it on your map. Go take it up with them. And by the divines, leave me alone now, all right? God. You know what? Fair enough. I got what I wanted. Have a good day. Goodbye. Goodbye. Um, so I did mark it on my map. Let's see here. Oh, it's like right there, too. Might as well fast travel to the Bruma Caverns. They're super, super close. Okay. Onward we go. Oh, yeah, there was a ton of stuff over here, huh? Western Watchtower. Oh, it's just another regular old watchtower. Who's there? Huh? Oh. Yeah, that scared me, actually. I'm 
trying so hard to freaking not hit that guy. Grimclaw? Oh. Okay. Mission accomplished, I guess. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. Oops, wrong button. And to hit this button. Oh, come on. Gotta find a way up there. All right. Whoop, a little janky. Here's the cave. Hello down there. All right, I'm saving the game because I know they're going to fucking try to kill me. What's going on? I sense yep. A presence. <gasps> Holy hell. Oh my god, that guy hit so hard. No, Wanathan! Ow! Holy crap, that actually scared me. Oh, get fucking shit on. I did not think... Daedric arrows, that's what fucked me up so hard. They're still talking? I mean, I'm over encumbered. Did I not put stuff back last time? I have sworn I did. Holy shit, I'm 100 pounds over. Uh, go to everything, go to weight. Oh, minor Lord's Mail. Interesting. Oh, it's probably all those fucking books I picked up, dude. Okay, that's good. Hello? Anyone else? Okay, that scared me. I don't know why. I was like, I heard other people talking. I don't seem to see any other people talking. Never mind. Gotcha, bitch. Take the topaz. Cool. Okay. Another one down, another one down. Oh, didn't I get a spell? I remember last episode, I got a spell that I never looked at. Let me find it real quick. Huh. Okay, never mind. I don't remember. I don't remember what it was. It might have been one of those, but I just it didn't it didn't pop out at me, so I guess yeah, they're all this way. Holy shit. Okay. Give me just a second here. Well, Wanathan is 
kicking ass down there. Or he's just being just enough a distraction to fuck everyone else up. Nope, sorry, Wanathan. I can't really see ya. Oh, actually, I think this thing might be out of... No, nope, it's not. I really can't tell if I'm hitting these people. God damn it, one of them. God, I hate wizards. Jesus Christ, I hate wizards because you can't fucking just get in. Can't close the distance. Oh, well, would you look at that? Now, who the hell over here died? That was the main guy. Oops, actually, yeah, I picked up those. Uh, these gloves that I most certainly have. Gloves. <laughs> I will go through that later. Huh. Huh. I guess, uh... I guess there wasn't no big name baddie. That's weird. I meant to go to items. And I'm going to go to everything. Sort by weight. First thing that comes up. Oh. I already have these. Oops. I meant to hit R. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. I think that's good there. Oh, hi, Wanathan. Okay. Now, it said it was clear. So I think now it's just time to find the artifacts, it seems. Probably in this big chest. Nope. Nope. Experimentation log. Cool. God damn it. Oh, there we go. Oh, and there's something over there, too. Let me see if I can get over there with the, uh... Ye old glider. That's something I'd be able to do. It does not look like it, honestly. Nope. Hmm. How actually would you get over there? Now that I'm looking at it. It's super weird that they would just put a chest over there. Not have any way to get to it. Oh, fuck. Okay, let me get this one more try. One good old college try. Oh, let's go, dude. Not worth it at all. 
Okay. Well, I found... I found the guys. Search the bandit den for information about the thief's whereabouts. Okay, I guess I haven't found it yet. God damn it, I had it in my inventory this entire time. I just needed to read it. Okay. Well, that sucks, kind of. But oh well. Also, I did find the spell tome that I was looking for. Strangulation was the thing. Right here. Absorb 20 points of health. So, that's cool. Okay. Now... We get to backtrack back to the man with the plan to see if we can't find or maybe or maybe we go straight to the dude. I don't know. I actually didn't read it. I was so relieved. I just closed it. Okay. Is that in Bruma? Oops, it is. Okay. So let's fast travel there, just because I'm lazy. And then... We can just head over there. I actually, that's gonna bother the shit in me. I need to remove that. Thank you. Okay. Yoink. There he is. There's a skeeving thug inside my house. When are you going to do something? I got a pretty good There's a trap door inside your house. You know that. I don't want to march in there in case they're planning an ambush. There's a trap door inside my house. I didn't realize that until now. Let's just wait a few minutes and see if the thief decides to try his luck leaving the building before we do anything rash. Damn it all. Skeeving thieves can just wander inside while I'm sleeping and steal what little coin I have left to my name. Kinnereth, give me strength. Ah, oh, you're back. Come, well, we need to talk. As you can see, there's another problem to deal with. So now old Bartram's got a thug inside his house, apparently. Just wonderful. To be honest, I'd rather be dealing with this than going on Count Carvain's wild guar chase. <clears throat> I should ask before I march in there and deal with the thief. Did your investigation turn up any leads about the Count's precious artifacts? The thief's going to deliver them to the contact in the Bruma ca caverns. Found a lead. That's no small relief. I guess that means you go find him in the caverns while I go deal with the thief in Bothram's house. Apparently the trap door in Bothram's house leads to the caverns. That changes things. Well, at least now we can kill two birds with one stone. If it's true, that is. Under most circumstances, I'd insist on going in first. I'm captain of the guard. It's my duty to shoulder the risk. But, well, this reeks of an ambush. It makes more sense to go in prepared. Let's go. Oh. The way he worded that, it sounded like he was going to ask me to go in first. Oh, you son of a bitch. I am going in first. You're just going to stand... Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. Yeah, I'm going. Don't even worry, bro. I'm right behind you. Just what I needed. Go ahead. Rub salt right into the wound. What is the meaning of this? Why are you in Botram's house? And why in oblivion do you look like you're on death's doorstep? It all went wrong. The bandits tricked me. Typical. I wanted them to put in a good word for me with the cutters. But no, they lied. I gave their guy the artifacts. Then they started swinging. I narrowly escaped by climbing back through the trap door. I see. Well, I'm placing you under arrest for stealing Count Carvain's Akaviri artifact collection. At least you won't bleed out in here. Uh, I'm gonna have to deal with this guy. Slap him in irons and take him before the Count. Finally get Carvain off my back. I suppose that means it's down to you to deal with the bandits and retrieve the artifacts. You bitch. I know the caverns are a favorite haunt of bandits and criminal types. Lots of them down there. No need to clear them out. Not that I'd complain if you did. Just grab the artifacts. Best of luck. Yeah, I'm killing everyone. Ooh, interesting. 
Gonna save the game? Jesus Christ, I've saved so many fucking times. Yeah, I'm taking all this shit with me. Cause it'd be better in a museum anyway. Oh, here we fucking go. Are you kidding? Oh, I did it. That actually didn't take long. Take that, take that. Take it all. Fuck it. Fuck this man. Okay. Let me actually go... Lightning rune. Cool. Nice and mine. Oh no, I can't do this one. It's too hard. <laughs> Motherfucker. Now, how the hell do I open this? So stupid. I need to stop talking before I freaking... What was that? Cool. That was easy. Let's look at what he was fucking around with. Empty chest. Oh. Cool. Wait a minute. I've already been here. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Okay, whatever. Uh, this way? Boy, it's hard to tell what the fuck I'm looking at. Okay. I don't know. I feel like I like playing in third person. It's just I rarely get the opportunity to do so. Oh, that key was probably to the freaking... Safe. Oh, that was so stupid. Oh no, these bandits are coming in to steal everything I own. <laughs> I've cleared out the bandits, sir. Lamau, they got away with everything, though. All 14 septum you had, sir. So sad. Any books? Nope. Ooh, an exquisite helmet. Anyway. Time to go turn in the quest, I guess. I will play in third person because I like to. Even though it makes it hard to deal with indoors things. So I'll play in third person as much as I can outside of buildings and stuff. Sir, 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 I've got your shit. So this is the thief, Captain? Feeling clumsy you mean today? to say that my artifacts have been found? Yes, Count Carvain. He stole your artifacts and attempted to deliver them to the bandits operating in the Bruma Caverns. I see. Well, of course, I expect he shall be prosecuted to the full extent of the law. Now, my artifacts? Actually, this new friend of Bruma has them. And who's this? 
A friend responsible for tracking down the artifacts and finding the thief. Dirty penis, at your I'd service. I'd say they deserve most of the credit, Count Carvan. Ah, friend of Bruma. Such tales are always gratifying to hear of. In fact, Captain, would you mind giving us a moment to speak? Uh, of course. I'll just be waiting over there. I'd like to say a few words to this new friend of Bruma before they take their leave. Of course, Captain. Friend of Bruma. May I have a moment? <laughs> That's such a weird thing. They don't want to... They just call me friend of Bruma. Over the artifacts, gently if you please. Thank you very much. So, you tracked down the thief and found my artifacts. I am extremely grateful. Please, accept this small recompense from the treasury. Thank you for your service. Something makes me think you're not going to merely disappear, though. You're the kind to get tangled in all sorts of affairs, I'm sure. Farewell, friend to Bruma. Good luck. I do hope you remain loyal to the Bruma throne. 1250? Damn, boy, that's pretty good. Okay, well, let's talk to him now. It's rare to see someone so willing to help another these days. You went to great lengths to find those damned artifacts. And for that, you have my thanks. No problem, bro. I don't know what Count Carvain said to you, and I don't really mind. The Count and I don't always see eye to eye, but I have a duty. Anyway, something makes me think we may see each other again. People like you tend to make waves, don't they? Take this. A personal thank you gift from me. Safe travels, my friend. And thanks. What do you give me? What do you give me? 500 on top of that. God damn, boy. That's a fucking good haul for that amount of work. <laughs> but I'm going to call it there. I think we're going to continue our time in Bruma here. That was super cool. Oh, look how nice that church looks against that sky. Uh, well, I'm going to have to call it there. Um, next time we'll be continuing doing some quests in Bruma, it seems. I'll see you in the next one.